I don't know what to ask you. I don't know what to say after that. Have you ever been involved in anything like that or seen anything like that in your football? Yeah, no, nah, I haven't experienced something like that before. I think I think it shows a testament to to the spirit that we've got, the team that we've got, um, the mentality to put in a performance like that when you're sort of up against it and the odds are against you. I think it's a huge shout to our, to our mentality for sure. What's going through your mind, though, when you've you brought on 84 minutes, one nil down, facing going out? Yeah, I think grateful to take the responsibility. It's where I want to be. I want to be playing and on the pitch. And whenever you're called upon, you've got to be ready. You've got to do what you do and bring what you bring to the team. So I tried to do that today. I tried to give everything I've got. And thankfully, thankfully it's worked out today and we've got the, the victory. Yeah, he's, again, big player. Um, he said that's about so many players today, so many big performances today. And... Without the spirit, the, the energy, and the, the belief that we've got, we wouldn't we wouldn't be win today. So, very very important, I think. You must have thought it was gone as you going into injury time. <coughs> did you? And then, do you believe just that? What do you say about him and that goal that he scored? I don't think you can you can ever really be thinking about it being gone. You got to think about the moment that you're in and doing everything that that moment calls for. Um, in that moment, he scored an overhead kick. So. I think that shows the level of quality that we've got in the team and especially in difficult moments you're going to have individual quality to, to bring you out so very important mentally everything come together today and that was that's the most important thing. A bit of everything, a bit of everything I think. Of course we know that we can play better at times in periods but I feel like the, honestly the, the mentality and the belief to come back in that fashion to perform how we performed is, is something that you can't you can't speak highly enough of. So yeah, big for us. Yeah, for sure he's a he's an important player for the team. We've seen his performances throughout the whole tournament, but we've got players ready to come on, ready to do the job, ready to perform and I'm sure we sure we'll work it out for sure. Thanks, nice one. What do you say after that? Uh, a bit of a crazy game, wasn't it? Um, but no, everyone's buzzing to get through the next round and that was, of course, the most important thing. Uh, I think we showed great character tonight uh, to you know stick to the plan and, and stay focused to, to get that goal um, in the end. But, you know, we know we can be better. We can play better and create more chances. But I think the, to, the, to show the great team we are is to win games like that, uh, where we're not playing at our best. And um, a lot of credit to the, uh, to the boys, for sure. You sound very calm. Did your heart rate come down here? <laughs> yeah, just about. Um, of course, I, you know, I came onto the pitch to show energy and, and try and see out the game. Uh, in, in, in a difficult time, <clears throat> but um, a lot of credit to the boys to, for the character they've shown, and it was a, a fantastic win. What's going through your mind? What was your emotion when Jude Bellingham scored that opening? Just honestly buzzing like every single English fan. Um, incredible goal, incredible moment. A lot, of, a lot of credit to him and and all the boys that were playing. Uh, it was an incredible night. Big responsibility for you, though, because. Yeah, well, obviously, at the end of the 90 minutes, it was obviously a bit messy because we're trying to get the goal. And then the second half of extra time, you know, Gareth and Steve wanted to have that bit of stability and, and control bringing on me and, and Esri and um, of course it was a tough time to come on but I think we done well and showed great character to see through the game. What does this do for England's belief? You keep saying we haven't played as well as we could have done but yeah. moments like this can change momentum, it can change destiny, can't they, in a tournament? Yeah, I think, I think our togetherness has become even stronger after, after tonight and... Um, like you've said and we've said, we know we can play better, uh, create more chances and 
just play better football in, in, in general. I think the defensive side of it and the togetherness in, in, uh, off the ball is, is there, but just on the ball in the final third, we, we can be better. We've got world-class players, so I've got no doubt we will show that. And uh, we're really excited and positive going into the next game. Really tough game. Uh, watched them uh, last night. Was it last night? I think uh, they were. They played uh, really well, and they're a top team. So we're going to prepare properly. And like I said, we're really positive going into that game. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, they're they're a great team. So we're going to have to be at our best. Thanks, guys. Cheers. Good to see you too. Have you ever come on in a game and been under that sort of pressure? No, definitely not. But. Um, you know, it was my, my major tournament debut. So, um, you know, no matter the result or how the game's going, it's always a great feeling to come onto the pitch. And obviously, to top it off, we, we got the win. Okay. I, I don't know how you dreamt of making your major tournament debut, especially in the various times you've been through. I can't imagine you anything like that. Definitely not. Um, not in my, my normal position as well. But um, like I've said before, wherever the gaffer wants to play me, um, I'm always ready to step in and, and do, a, do a job for the team. What do you say about that goal? Yeah, it's a great goal. Sums up his, uh, his season and um, you know he got us back into the game, so credit to him. What was the atmosphere like in the After. Yeah, um, a bit quiet at the start because everyone was tired. But um, no, look, the manager spoke to us and uh, he was buzzing and so were we. Uh, all focus now turns on to Switzerland next week. A hundred percent. We know that we haven't been playing our best football, um, but it just shows that we've got a lot more to come. You know, when you don't necessarily play well, but uh, you can still dig out results like we did today. Um, we know that next week's going to be tough as well, so we'll be well prepared, I'm sure, and um, you know, I'm sure we'll play better as well. Yeah, 100. percent I'm always ready. Um, and look, it's a it's a big disappointment for Mark. He's been great for us, but um, look, it's one game, and, and I'm sure once we get through, we'll be back in. Thank you, thank you very much, thank you.